More than two dozen restaurants in Silver Spring are preparing to celebrate the area's first annual restaurant week, and you're invited to check it out. Susan Kennedy has a story. The promotion is the brainchild of Councilmember Tom Hucker, whose district includes Silver Spring. Uh, no, we met him at Jackie's Restaurant, one of the participants in the event, and he told us That's Restaurant true. Week That's will true. feature the cream of the crop. There's been a tremendous growth in all the, uh, the restaurant scene in Silver Spring. This is really a chance to celebrate the diversity of the dining options we have in Silver Spring to encourage our residents to take a look at the, the wide breadth of restaurants that have opened in Silver Spring recently. The week of September 8th through the 13th, participating restaurants will offer special lunches between $12 and $17 and dinner specials between $17 and $27. The goal is to highlight the growing Silver Spring restaurant scene in hopes of attracting patrons from across the region. A lot of those people, they think only to come down to Bethesda, only to come into Washington, D.C. When there's a lot of restaurants in Silver Spring, I mean, it's exploding right now. We've been here for a long time, but there's new restaurants opening every day, you know, along Georgia Avenue, you know, in downtown Silver Spring. So there's a lot of great places for everybody that's living in northern Montgomery County that lives in northern Virginia that they can come here and get a great experience. This is a uh, lobster cream for our uh, lobster tagliatelle. A great meal that they would get in D.C., that they would get in Bethesda. You know, we're, we're on par with everybody else. We're fairly new here, having just opened in April. Um, we're excited to be a part of the business community here and uh, really excited to show uh, all of Silver Spring citizens what we have to offer. They can try a fine dining establishment like Jackie's here that maybe they thought they couldn't afford. Um, and they can also try many of our new entries like, um, like Urban Winery, Mixed Bar and Grill that have opened just in the last few weeks. Hucker says he's pleased how the restaurant community has embraced the event. His office is footing the bill for the publicity for Restaurant Week and there are no entry fees. This isn't just for the residents of Silver Spring. We're looking to sort of attract people from all different parts of the county and possibly even Virginia. Well, that's the thing. I think that it's a story that doesn't get told often enough, that we have an entertainment scene and a restaurant scene that rivals anywhere in the metro area, um, that rivals Bethesda, rivals downtown D.C., and rivals northern Virginia. We want folks to come from all over and enjoy our restaurants, but one of the great things about Silver Spring, too, is they can stay and catch a great movie at the AFI or Regal Cinemas. They can catch some free music outside, uh, live music on, the pl on Veterans Plaza or Ellsworth Drive after their meal. To find out which restaurants are participating in the event, you can visit the website at silverspringrestaurantweek.com. I'm Susan Kennedy for County Report This Week.